y and r shockers unveiled, Abbott family turmoil explodes. Ashley's mystery deepens, Tucker's intrigue, Lily's revenge unleashed. Plus, double baby bombshell rocks Genoa City. What's next for Abby, Summer, and more? And is Patty Williams' fiery comeback on the horizon? Find out now. Hello everyone, welcome to my channel, I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. After watching these videos, please hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. Tucker looks into it, Ashley spins out, and Lily becomes ferocious. According to spoilers for the upcoming week of March 25th to 29th on The Young and the Restless, Kyle Abbott will be having trouble adjusting to the power dynamics at Chabot and will be harboring resentment against Diane Jenkins Abbott. Kyle finds it embarrassing and annoying that his mother is controlling him while he wants to be the co-CEO. It will be even simpler for Kyle to overstep the mark in his approach as Diane gains more self-assurance in her role. Since Diane is the one who should be giving the commands, Kyle's tendency to believe that he always knows best could cause problems. Diane is going to approach Kyle and give him a hard time for going outside the line. She expects a phony apology and a lot of attitude in return from her resentful son. However, as Ashley Abbott's mental health will continue to deteriorate, that won't be the first Abbott-related crisis that arises. Ashley isn't acting like herself, which will cause Jack Abbott and many of Ashley's other family members to become increasingly concerned. Fans of YNR are aware that Ashley has numerous personalities that have been vying for dominance, and there's excellent reason for that. Because of Ashley's peculiar behavior, which appears to be getting stranger every day, Tucker McCall has already expressed suspicion. Tucker would not have to wait long to confront Ashley to inquire about the strange text she sent him instructing him to disregard anything she said. Tucker might pressure Ashley to tell him what the hell is going on because it was stated that she never wanted to see him again. By then, if Ashley's aggressive side has resurfaced, she might invent a story to divert attention from the message. Even yet, Audra Charles's anger will rise as Tucker becomes concerned for Ashley's welfare. It appears that Tucker might convince Audra to stick by her decision to end the relationship by providing additional evidence of his obsession with Ashley. Tucker will attempt to express his viewpoint, but by grabbing Audra by the arm and attempting to confine her, he will overreach himself. Nate Hastings will be able to see the altercation and advise Tucker to keep his hands off Audra as a result. Even while Audra might argue that she can manage on her own, there's a chance that she admires Nate's bravery in stepping up. Lily Winters, on the other hand, won't require assistance in retaliating against Heather Stevens and Daniel Romilotti Jr. Following their confrontation at the coffee shop, Lily will leave Heather wondering if she will be fired from Chancellor Winters. Daniel will also encounter significant opposition from Lily, therefore depending on Lily's decision, both Daniel and Heather may lose their jobs. The Newmans will also need to deal with the conclusion of Jordan's terror campaign and analyze all that has transpired. In the episode broadcast on March 20, the show hinted that Jordan was dead, but was she truly gone forever? In any case, Claire Grace will have to face a brand new future and could worry that her evil past will resurface. Finally, we anticipate more co-parenting conflict since Chelsea Lawson and Adam Newman will need to agree on Connor Newman's treatment plan. Keep checking back for updates on all the mayhem. According to spoilers for The Young and the Restless, the week of March 25th to 29th will offer some shocking news and intense showdowns. The next update for today. Baby fever strikes Genoa City, a startling double pregnancy for Abby and Summer? Spoilers for the young and the restless reveal a possible future development as well as a prediction regarding Claire Grace's dream. The episode from March 20th gave viewers an intriguing glimpse at Claire's life if she had received all the love from Newman that she was due. A moment where Eve revealed Claire's wishes to other guests at the table was part of Claire's fantasy birthday celebration. 
As a result, Dominic Newman Abbott Winters Chancellor's younger brother or sister was wished for by Abby Newman Abbott and Devin Hamilton Winters. Shortly after, Summer Newman and Kyle Abbott declared that they too desired a younger sibling for Harrison Abbott. It's intriguing that Summer and Abby both want children in Claire's dream, even if Kyle and Summer aren't together as they were in that scenario. Could this be interpreted as a kind of premonition regarding some upcoming pregnancies? Given that Abby loves being a mother to Dominic, it makes sense that she would wish to become a mother again soon. Given how content and secure their family is with Dom, Abby and Devin may choose to grow it. Maybe Abby would be able to carry a child to term on her own, or maybe she would once more employ a surrogate. Since Summer and Chance Chancellor are still relatively new to each other, her situation is a little more complicated, but it's possible that her pregnancy was an unexpected gift. Unexpected buns in the oven wouldn't be the first thing to happen to a YNR character. Summer might be open to the notion of having a child with Chance if she gets over her possible shock. It might be employed to further develop Chance and Summer's relationship. Chance was previously informed that his problems with sperm and motility will go away on their own, allowing him to become Summer's father and start a family. However, Claire's dream might be a sign that Summer will eventually get back to Kyle or at least sleep in his bed again. What would happen if they gave in to temptation and Summer ended up pregnant by Kyle? In any case, Claire's dream appeared to have given Abby and Summer the baby fever, so maybe it will materialize and result in actual pregnancies. Watch this space for updates on any upcoming child-related news as Summer and Abby tackle some new challenges. Don't miss what's in store since spoilers for the young and the restless suggest that other GC residents may also get baby fever. The next update for today. Is Patty Williams' comeback imminent, the next big thing to take the place of Jordan drama? According to teasers for The Young and the Restless, a fresh plot line will soon be required for the program to capture viewers' interest. For a while, Jordan's crazy antics succeeded, but now it's time to be ready for the next big event. When YNR resurrected the evil Cameron Kirsten to ruin Sharon Newman's life, they were successful. Nick and Faith Newman soon became entangled in the chaos. Jordan was then introduced in order to cause havoc for Nikki, Victor, and the other Newman family members. Maybe it's Jack Abbott and Diane Jenkins Abbott's turn to cope with a crazy person who wants retribution. Is Patty Williams planning a spectacular comeback? Diane and Jack are happily married, so perhaps it's time to throw their world into disarray and present some significant obstacles. Since Jack's previous relationship with Diane is what initially pushed Patty over the edge, it makes logical to bring her back. Patty may manage to get out of Fairview or wherever she is currently incarcerated. Patty might target Diane and Jack if she finds out about their reunion. Naturally, Patty's mental state seems to fluctuate depending on what the plot requires. There have been occasions when Patty was so lost in thought that she would just talk endlessly about candies and cats. Patty has already experienced catatonia as well, but perhaps she has recovered enough to play Diane and Jack like a legitimate villain. Given that improbable events frequently occur on this soap opera, YNR may even develop a plot in which Patty is found to have undergone rehabilitation. If Patty is freed, she might act like everything is all right before going completely crazy and hurting Jack and Diane. Days of Our Lives star Stacey Hayduk portrays Kristen DiMera, but it doesn't appear that she is under contract, which might mean that she may return to the show as Patty Williams. But, it's feasible that Patty's character will be recast, particularly because she has already undergone plastic surgery and might do so in order to conceal her identity. It seems like the perfect time, in any case, for Patty Williams to make a comeback and cause mischief. Keep checking back for updates on whether the young and the restless spoilers about Patty's freedom will materialize as bad news for Diane and Jack. Thanks for watching this videos. Please hit the subscribe button for more updated news.